Yeah, this is a project about finding new composers for the band. More than 200 people have applied for it and we have been playing and playing uh, a lot of scores and then we have uh, made some selection. So this week we had five composers, one each day from Spain, from Austria, from Netherlands and from Germany of course. Uh, and it's so great to meet them and, uh, and play their music. Hello, I'm Suzanne Veneman and I am a trumpet player and composer from the Netherlands. I was kind of nervous. <laughs> Also to see a lot of new faces and uh, not sure if they would like my music and if there were mistakes in the parts perhaps. And also to hear your own music played by a band that you don't know and their own interpretation to something that you hold so close to you is uh, yeah, it's kind of nerve wracking. I could feel the interpretation, when I told them what it was about, I could immediately feel the whole band shifting and putting their emotion in the music in a different way. Is that better? Okay, one, two, three, two, two, three. My name is Alex Casañas, uh, and I'm a composer, arranger, and also a big band conductor uh, from Barcelona. Da -da 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 with more marcato, with tongue. Tongue, but long notes. Well, that long note. So, do -do 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 The song is called El Testament d'Amelia. It's a Catalan traditional uh, song from the mid age. And I wanted to do a range of them for this song because uh, when I was a kid, uh, I loved uh, that song. Diversity is uh, absolutely there. Uh, some of them are uh, more uh, jazzy uh, and some are more modern, uh, but all of them knows about orchestration. That's the main thing for us, that it sounds good for us, uh, as long as it's good, it's good written. Hello, I'm Frederik Köster, trompeter, komponist, arrangeur from Köln. Ich habe mir gedacht, ich würde gerne ein ganz neues Stück schreiben, weil ich dachte, wenn die NDR Big Band einen einlädt, dann sollte das exklusiv sein. Und habe das sozusagen unterwegs geschrieben, weil ich die letzten Wochen eigentlich so ins viel gereist bin. Und das Stück heißt Road Trip und das ist sozusagen, da ist der Name im Programm. Bei Percy habe ich eigentlich schon beim Schreiben daran gedacht, dass ich eigentlich das mir sehr gut vorstellte, wenn er das spielt. Und deswegen habe ich das dann in seinen Part reingeschrieben und kannte ihn auch vorher schon, hatte ihn schon mal im Clang Festival gehört und wusste, dass es ein äh, sehr guter Spieler und ja, der hat mich auch wieder überrascht. Aber ich glaube, darum geht es, sich immer wieder zu überraschen als Musiker und dadurch sich inspirieren zu lassen.
if, if you could make it more dirty, I don't know. I know it, the politics in Hungary is a bit dirtier than here. So I... <laughs> Hi, I'm Daniel Hofecker. I'm from Hungary. I was very happy that they invited me here because I already knew that this band is one of the best in the world. They can read everything almost perfectly in the first moment and the soloists are also really great. So it, it was amazing to work with them. One of the favorite moments is of course when uh, we have short time to record these pieces of course and it's shows up uh, something that looks really difficult and are <laughs> really difficult uh, and maybe impossible to play, but uh, in the end we, we nail it. My name is Tobias Hoffmann. Ich bin äh, Saxophonist, Komponist und Arrangeur, bin eigentlich gebürtig aus Deutschland, lebe aber mittlerweile in Österreich und Wien und in Graz. Ich habe das letztes Jahr im September ge geschrieben, nachdem ich eine Auseinandersetzung mit jemandem hatte, habe das so angefangen, so in, aus einer Mischung aus, ja nicht negativer Energie würde ich es nicht beschreiben, aber so eine dunkle Energie. Ja, das Stück fordert alle Musiker sehr heraus und es ist eins wahrscheinlich der schwereren Stücke, die ich geschrieben habe. Yes, I'm very okay. happy. Thank you very much. Thank so, you guys. Thanks a lot. Real good challenge Wednesday morning. Thanks for fighting through it. Yeah, yeah, whatever. This is uh, great to do. It's needed because we need new music in this uh, format, the big band format. We need to look forward and uh, and to have a uh, kind of window uh, to the world out there and see what's happening. So please send in more material and uh, everybody and we will we already plan productions in the future with other composers from the same project. So it's been a big success for us and for the composers I hope. Now I feel relieved and happy and <laughs> relaxed. <laughs> I'm very happy with this opportunity. It's a really big, big thing if you can meet a an orchestra like this. Das ist Therapie, selbst spielen, Musik hören, Musik schreiben. Ich weiß noch, dass ich mir immer vorgestellt habe, irgendwann möchte ich das äh, erreichen, dass so eine Band meine Musik spielt. Und das ist für mich einfach ja, so ein bisschen Dream come true, dass das heute passiert ist. Musik